My name is Peter Sprigg. I'm a senior fellow at Family Research Council. I've been doing research on uh, family and human sexuality for 19 years now and on the transgender issues for the last five years. A recent study implied that puberty blockers reduce the risk of suicide. I analyzed the full text of that study and learned that those who received puberty blockers were actually twice as likely to have had a suicide attempt that resulted in hospitalization in the last 12 months. So, supporters of these procedures uh, will often tell you that they are evidence-based. This is misleading at best. I analyzed the Endocrine Society guidelines for these procedures. All but one of the 24 guidelines relevant to minors were supported either by no evidence or by evidence of low or very low quality. What we are witnessing here is a vast medical experiment upon vulnerable children.